Haha! <laughs> Might as well across the shop. And uh, back in the back uh, a while back, I showed I put this picture up. Fucking focus, you bastard! When I was talking about the V notches in the banjos, and I sent um, there was loads of uh, people with comments and stuff. Some people got it right, some people got it wrong, or whatever. Yeah, it's just one of those things. So I literally uh, contacted um, Hell, and we killed some kids. And I said. Could you basically, you know, I've got a YouTube channel, can you basically tell us, me and the guys, uh, why these V-notches are there? Some people said it's about wrapping um, uh, locking wire. Well, no, because locking wire bolts have holes in them, and I'll put a picture of that. And that, this has no holes in it. Uh, the notches on the top of the banjo bolts had to indicate, this is from, sorry, this is from Sean Northcott, um, who works at Hell. Uh, hell break products, blah 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 blah. It says the notches on top of the banjo bolts are to indicate that it is a metric thread. The imperial bolts don't have the notches. It helps to identify them as a visual, uh, as a 13, uh, a 3 8 13. The 3 8 JIC thread looks very familiar to the M10 by 1. Cheers, uh, best regards, Sean. So, thank you very much, Sean, and thank you for getting back to me. You know, you could have just gone there, uh, fuck that. Um, so that's the reason they are literally just to signify that they are metric. Obviously, they probably have bins, and when they make up the kits, they come in the boxes. They, you know, just make sure that it's a metric kit and what have you. Or when they're sorting them in the warehouse, who knows? That's what they do it for. That's a really quick, short one, but uh, we have an answer. So in the future, when you want to impress your girlfriends and all this, you're crowded around your bike. You go, ah, the the notches are for the uh, the uh, metric identification, <laughs> and then you might, you might get a blowjob. <laughs> That and the screaming kids, it's just all wrong. Hope that makes sense, and I'll see you in a bit.